Dear brothers in arms, I am the commander of the Polish Special Mission Unit GROM. There are my warriors, GROM operators behind me. Now we are standing in significant place to our unit, our CQB training facility. Right here, our soldiers train demanding and complicated scenario every day and night in order to be prepared for combat operations. Today we are displaying a memory board dedicated to Major Rashid Hussein Ziyu, Jordanian Special Forces Unit Commander, who bravely has fallen in combat in 2016. This board is in honor of the Jordanian hero. It shall also mark the importance of the cooperation between Jordanian and Polish Special Operation Forces. For the first time, we met Rashid in February 2016 in Kasutek. Uh, he invited a few of us to his compound on the hilltop. As we didn't know anything about his unit, he showed us around and introduced us to his teammates. We were impressed how professional his unit was. So we decided to organize a common exercise for our teams. As a Polish defense attaché to Jordan in years 2012-2017, I participated in security defense cooperation between Polish and Jordanian um, special forces. Major Zyut, uh, who I met several times and we conducted several meetings and long, long discussions, appeared as a very smart young officer who was very dedicated to his service. He was a visionary. He was a person who uh, had the bright ideas and he had excellent vision of cooperation with Polish uh, special forces. He was well trained, he was well skilled, he was well prepared to be a leader for his secret service unit. A few days later we went to Jordan Sokon commander to get a permission for the training. After leaving the commander's office we stopped for a while at the big painting of His Majesty the King of Jordan. There we took a photo with Rashid, probably the last one in his life. 24 hours later, he was killed in combat operation in Irbit. His, this symbolic photo will constitute the main part of the memory play. This is why the first day of March 2016 for Polish community, for soldiers of Grom and me personally, brings a bitter taste uh, memories, mixed feelings. Because on the one hand, this is the day when we celebrate excellent, exceptional beginning of the relations between Grom and Jordanian and the respective units. But on the other hand, this is the day when Major Rashid dedicated to his service, he sacrificed his life to defend Jordan, Jordanians and ourselves. After the exercise with Rashid's team, our training in Jordan came to an end, so we invited our Jordanian friends for a goodbye dinner to exchange gifts and talk a little about the future. They all promised to come, but they didn't make it. As we were waiting for our Jordanian friends in the restaurant, we were completely unaware that at the very same time they were fighting Daesh in a big operation in Irbit. At about 2100, we received a phone call informing that Rashid was seriously wounded. Two hours later, he was 
confirmed that five other members of his team were also wounded. Suddenly we had to switch our farewell meeting for a funeral in Zarka. There were lots of people at the funeral and His Majesty the King of Jordan himself attended the sad ceremony. As the crowd dispersed, we saw Rashid's teammates sitting at the fresh grave of their commander. As they spotted the Polish delegation, they came up, brought us to the grave. We sat together as brothers, paying tribute to the fallen soldier. The next day we went to Zarka again, this time to pay condolences to Rashid's father. We presented the father with a gift, a small statuette of a Grom operator. The very same gift we were supposed to give to his son the previous night. To commemorate his uh, memory, commander of Grom and also um, the soldiers of this unit decided to uh, pay this great respect uh, for his memory uh, by naming um, his they, they, they best uh, training facility in the unit. Also, it's a respect for family of Major Rashid. For us also it's a symbolic way to tribute all fallen soldiers of Jordanian Armed Forces, Special Forces, as well Secret Services. Uh, we keep all those names of fallen Jordanian soldiers in our hearts and thoughts. Among them, Major Muad Huaytat, who passed away several months after Major Rashid. For us, those officers and soldiers from Jordanian Armed Forces, they are warriors, they are heroes, they are brothers in arms.